Hi, here I'm going to show you the EWRF E7086TM3 VTX. Just cut it open. So it's a uh, 48 channel 5.8 gigahertz VTX. It outputs uh, 25 milliwatts, 200 milliwatts, or 600 milliwatts, and has an off position too for the power. Uh, it has a uh, RPSMA connector. Um, it has a working voltage of. Uh, 6 to 24 volts and uh, it also has a 5 volt out for your camera if you need it but I think the neat feature about this it has a PWM OSD input so what that means is you can connect it to your uh, flight controller and configure the power settings and the channel and band through your Betaflight OSD. Um, there's like two buttons here. One is for the power settings, the power level settings, and the other one is for the uh, channel and band settings. So what I'll do is I'll show you how to wire it up to the to a F3 board, an Omnibus F3 board. Okay, so on this board here, I'm going to be connecting, um, first I'm going to be joining the RAM and the VBAT, which will give full battery voltage to these two terminals here, which is the video in and the video out. That's because both my camera and uh, the VTX here will will support full battery voltage. Now I'm going to be running my camera straight off the flight controller. So I'm going to de-pin these three wires. Green wire goes to a open UART. In this case, I'm going to be using, I believe that this J12 here. That's a UART two, I think, which is, and that's a transmit line. That's it for wiring. Oh, I still gotta jump these two wires here. I'm just double checking my wiring. Oh, I see what I did wrong. I wired the VTX to the input side. Huh. Okay, well that's easily fixed.
Okay, so this is how it's supposed to be wired up. Next, I'll show you on Beta Flight how to set it up. Okay, so you want to connect to Beta Flight, then go under Ports, and under the UR2, under the Peripherals, you want to select TBS Smart Audio. Save and reboot, and then you're done. Okay, so I'm gonna put our lens cap so you can see a bit better. Now, to get into the menu, you want to go mid throttle, the auto left, and up. And then go at the main menu, I'm gonna go to Features, VTX SA for Smart Audio, and now we're in the Smart Audio menu. On the top, you'll see the uh, the frequency and the uh, power level. Uh, then we have the band, so you have a choice of Boss Cam, Fat Shark, or Race Band, and the channel you can select, as you can see there. Uh, then you got the power levels you can select 25, 200, 500, and 800. But it won't go to 800 because it doesn't have 800. And I guess where they're actually limited to 500 milliwatts. So I'll set it back down to 25. Go to set. Say yes to save. And then that's it. I'll leave you with a little bit of uh, flight footage, and uh, thanks for watching.